Hello and a very warm welcome. In today's video we're going to talk about Lewis Hamilton's replacement and who is it going to be in 2025. Lewis has one more season with Mercedes. Hopefully he can get a win under his belt. I think he deserves that for the career he's had with Mercedes in particular. But who's going to replace him in 2025? Now we have some faces on the screen that I think are the main candidates, but comment down below your thoughts. I did a poll the other day, and a lot of people think uh, Albon. Uh, he won the vote. I'm just getting it up now. Here we're with 64%. We had a few comments on there. Uh, mostly a stopgap, like Albon, until Antonelli's ready. I think Albon, but I would like to see Alonso, and then Alonso by David. So yeah, we got 7% for Sainz. Oh, it's gone down now, someone's just voted. 7% um, for Sainz, 60 for Albon, 27 for Antonelli, and 7 for Other. So, yes, let's jump into it. Now, we'll start with Fernando Alonso. Obviously, two-time champion. Why would Mercedes not try and sign someone like Alonso, the most experienced driver on the grid? And yeah, look at his performance last season in Aston Martin. Um, yeah, obviously, if you got the chance to sign Alonso, and you know Alonso has had loads of teams, so he would definitely be up for that. And he gets on well with George Russell, so yeah. Only a couple of weeks ago, they posted a video of them playing like ping pong on the plane, traveling to races and back. So Alonso's a candidate. I would love to see that, not going to lie. Fernando Alonso in a Mercedes. Wow, that would be. And with George Russell as teammates. We'll jump into Kimi Antonelli. Now, not many people will know who this guy is, but... Kimi Antonelli, there's a lot of hype about this guy. He will be competing in Formula 2 this season. If he has a good Formula 2 season, who knows what the future holds. Will he be given an opportunity to jump straight in to the Mercedes? Maybe a tall order. But if he has a good F2 season, I don't see no reason why he can't go to like a Williams or somewhere and then get promoted to Mercedes. I think putting him straight in would be a big ask. But let's see what he does in Formula 2. Then we've got Carlos Sainz. You've got a feel for Carlos Sainz. He's lost his seat at Ferrari through no fault of his own, really. He won the race last season. The only guy to do so that was non-Red Bull. But yeah, Carlos Sainz is heavily linked with Audi. Um, yeah. Mercedes, I don't know, I don't see this one. I think Sainz may end up at Audi. Um, this is just my opinion. I think Sainz will end up at the Audi partnership. Um, yeah. Jumping into the next one, Alex Albon. Um, yeah, on my particular poll, he's got the most votes, 60%. I think Albon will be the next Mercedes driver. I've got to be straight to the point. I don't think Albon, I don't think that would work. Russell and Albon, it would be two nice, two nice environments as they're good mates. And there was a story came out last night. F1 journalist Peter Windsor reporting Albon will end up back at Red Bull for 2025. I think that would be an absolute car crash if that is true for Alex Albon's career. Formula 1 career, going back to a team that sacked him. Yeah. An outside-of-the-box choice, Valtteri Bottas, was with Mercedes before he got replaced by George Russell. Could that be an option? Valtteri Bottas returning to the Brackley-based outfit. Um, yeah, won races, pole positions, but was always a number two to Lewis. Another outside-the-box choice, Esteban Ocon, obviously he's been with the Mercedes program before, gets on quite well with Toto Wolff, that could be an option. And then you've got a 
big outside the box choice. Someone like Lando Norris. Obviously, he's just signed a big deal with McLaren, but we know contracts can be broken. If Mercedes go and give McLaren a huge sum for Norris, they could get him. It's just like football, really. If you offer the money, you can break these contracts. Is there anyone I've missed? Comment down below your thoughts. Who do you want to see replace Lewis Hamilton for the 2025 season? George Russell. Hopefully, Mercedes can produce a car. George Russell going to be the number one, but who's going to be alongside him? Comment down below. Um, should be an interesting one. I think Alonso, that's a big show. Antonelli, Sainz. But yeah, there's a few, a lot of hype around Alex Albon, but with that uh, journalist reporting that he could go back to Red Bull, um, yeah, and he's actually a decent journalist, Peter Windsor, so let's see if that's got any leverage. Then outside of the choices, like a Bottas, an Ocon, a Norris, um, yeah. Vesti, Vesti deserves a mention as well, I nearly missed him. He's with the Mercedes ranks as well, Frederick Vesti. Um, yeah, let's see what happens. But yeah, comment down below your thoughts. Be interesting to know.